Airmog Transport Ventilator 6000S, which is the best rescuer in different emergency and transport situations. It has a compact size and lightweight only about 1.3 kg. It is equipped with a portable first aid bag and a hanger. The device includes a built-in voice guidance system that accurately prompts all alarm information and directs medical staff through the operation process, making the procedure convenient and quick. 6000 has, has passed EN1789 medical vehicle test and it has a great drop and shock resistance, allowing it to handle a variety of complicated transportation conditions. It also has a built-in large capacity lithium battery that can last for more than 10 hours when fully charged. During the operation, make sure the breathing circuit and the O2 is correctly connected. Press on-off button for 3 seconds to turn on the ventilator. The ventilator will directly go into IPPV mode for an easy and quick rescue. Press assist button to get into assist control mode. It has a 2.4 inches display screen for monitoring the life parameters like peak airway pressure and mean airway pressure, as well as the pressure waveform. It has a special feature of CPR. By pressing the CPR button, it will get into CPR mode. 6000S can be connected to our CPR device E6 via Bluetooth and they can be synchronized together. It means the CPR device will provide compressions to the patient and ventilator will provide breathes to the patient. It has a air mix and no air mix switch. It has three navigation knobs in the center to control different settings during the ventilation. Pmax knob is used to set different Pmax values. Frequency knob is used to set different breathing frequencies. MV knob is used to maintain different minute volume for the patient. It has four alarm indicators on the top. Stenosis means the airway is blocked. Disconnection means breathing circuit is disconnected from the patient. 2.7 bar O2 means not enough O2 pressure. No assist means patient is not triggering. To make the process more convenient for the doctors to guess what is the reason for alarm. 